break the news, like breaking news to you guys that. Shata Wale, who we all know that is into that soul and the hey, Kepu, Kepu, Shata, hey, Frido, that thing, like that's for vibes. Now, Shata is venturing into something else, transitioning into something else, which is the Afro beat. And this is something we so so don't know much about Shata Wale, because Shata Wale is always like, hey, the King Gosen, hey, Zangin Amiga, hey, JJC. But if he's doing Afro beats now, is he actually switching from that soul? To do alphabets now because it looks like now the whole world is giving their attention to alphabet. Even these diasporans now want to do uh, uh, alphabet, they want to feature us. We've seen some of the things like Kwame Nijer with Rotimi, and even Luda Chris also came to Ghana vibing with Sarko Dates, which we're anticipating for something. So now, even the, the Westerners are also coming down here. What is happening? So I feel like Shata Wale, I feel like if he doesn't you know, switch or do something about alphabet, he's gonna lose because the more you get into that, too, the more collaborations you get. Because now everyone is into alphabet. If you're not doing alphabet, no one will feature you. What do you think about that, too? But he has brought out some teasers about what we should be expecting with the alphabet suit and all of that. And he's brought out something we call waiting. Waiting. Hey, Charlie, it's a vibe, man. You know, Shata does like when they drop it a bag. Man, they do all things. They compose, they write, they sing, they promotion, everything, like Shata. So another one is here. We they come give you guys back to back. Shawale is coming with the waiting, and let's take a listen to one of the alphabet tunes by Shawale. <laughs> You can always trash that Tawale with the banger. Like, just tell me, don't you like the song? Isn't it something about, like, is it, is it not giving? Hey, we did the first year, it is the way drop people and three more because we did a lot shower. We did a lot shower. We did a lot shower. And trust me, the song is just a banger. For me, um, I'm already resonating to it. I love the rhythm and everything. But it's just beautiful to see Shatawale relating to Afrobeats because that is where the money day now. Hey, if you know, enter. Please have. I, I was a rapper, but now I'm considering doing like Afro beats. Who I will feature first? Okay, I will try Shatta Wale. Since he's also Nigeria, we will start to get that. But hey, he made a tweet basically and he categorized his fan bases. I didn't know Shatta has, you know, category of people that he calls his fan base. Which one do you think you belong to? Well, according to Shatta Wale, I have three different types of fans. The first one, reggae and dancehall fans, and then Afro beats fans, and then Shatta music fans. Please know where you belong to. Don't be greedy. Thank you. And then hashtag waiting produced by is your beat. So now the question is, which one do you fall under? Which one is your category? Are you a reggae and dancehall fan? Are you an Afrobeat fan? Are you a shutter music fan? Well, the reggae and dancehall is for we to get to. It's like, yo, we the hey, now we the scatter everywhere before we go scatter your head for you. We are the dancehall and the reggae category people. And then the Afrobeat is more like the professionals, the corporate people, people that love to relax, chill back, and then give it vibes on vibes, you know. That is that category too. And then the shutter music fans are for the market women. Hey! Again, the sun is still baby. In this song, even if it's not, not working in our reading, we just did through throw one hands, the market will go to yes. So which one do you fall under? Are you with the reggae or the alphabet or the shutter music? For me, I did everywhere. Like some network I know. I did everywhere. <laughs> I did in all the three categories. But let's still anticipate for Shatter Wallace tunes and let's rally and support because still the Mali album is out. We'll be kickstarting our world tour as well. So let's do the needful because we need to do this to push our artists. I remember at the VGMAs, you know, Star Codiers manager Angel made a statement that when our artists come to diaspora and we are there too and we know they are in, we should come out in our numbers to support them. That is the only way these Westerners will also step out and also support us. Well. But if we are not supporting our people, how do we expect them to support us? You get a point? So, Shatawale fans, Bim Nati fans, SM, like, Sakodie, Samini, everybody, we could just support. 